Welcome to Easy A Homeschool Academy. Let's learn about the human eye. The human eye is a complex organ with various parts, each having a specific function that contributes to the process of vision. Here are the main parts of the human eye and their functions. Let's learn more about the eye by taking a look at this cross-section model. Here is the sclera. This white outer layer of the eye provides structure and protection for the eyeball. It covers the entire outside of the eye except for the cornea. This is the choroid. This is the layer of blood vessels between the retina and the sclera. It supplies oxygen and nutrients to the retina. This is the pupil. The black circular opening in the center of the iris is called the pupil. It allows light to enter the eye and reach the retina. The size of the pupil increases or decreases depending on the amount of light entering the eye at any given time. It will enlarge to allow more light to enter the eye in dimly lit situations whereas it will get smaller to allow less light to enter the eye in high-intensity situations. Here is the iris. It is the colored part of the eye that controls the size of the pupil. By adjusting the pupil size, the iris regulates the amount of light that enters the eye. This is the cornea. It is the clair dome-shaped surface that covers the front of the eye. It helps to focus incoming light onto the retina. Next is the lens. This is a transparent, flexible structure behind the iris and pupil. It changes shape to focus light onto the retina, allowing us to see objects clearly at different distances, a process called accommodation. Here is the retina. This is a light-sensitive layer at the back of the eye. It contains photoreceptor cells, known as rods and cones, that convert light into electrical signals. Rods are responsible for vision in low light, while cones detect color and are responsible for sharp central vision. This is the optic nerve. This is the nerve that transmits electrical signals from the retina to the brain, where they are interpreted as visual images. This is called the vitreous humor. This is a gel-like substance that fills the space between the lens and the retina. It helps maintain the eye's shape and allows light to pass through to the retina. This area is called the macula. This is a small central area of the retina that provides the sharpest vision. It contains a high concentration of cones. Here is the ciliary body. This is the structure containing the ciliary muscle and ciliary processes. The ciliary muscle controls the shape of the lens and the ciliary processes produce the aqueous humor. This is the aqueous humor. This is a clear fluid that fills the space between the cornea and the lens. It provides nutrients to the eye and helps maintain intraocular pressure. Here is the conjunctiva. It is a thin, transparent membrane that covers the sclera and lines the inside of the eyelids. It helps protect the eye from infection and provides lubrication by producing mucus and tears. The human eye is a complex organ responsible for vision composed of various parts, each with specific functions. Each of these components play a vital role in the eye's ability to receive and process visual information, allowing us to see and interpret the world around us. I hope you learned something about the parts of the eye today. Thank you for taking this learning journey with me. Until next time.
As always, thank you for watching. Tell us what you want to see next. Email easyahomeschoolacademy at yahoo.com. Like and share our videos. Please subscribe to our channel.